A new audit is showing what went wrong on the first day of school last August in Howard County, causing major transportation issues. If you remember, in 2023, students saw major delays in getting to and from school, all at the hands of a new contractor hired by the school system. But as Fox 45's Jessica Babb is learning, school officials are also accountable. Jessica. Yeah, Mackenzie, the independent audit says what happened in 2023 was the result of people not making decisions or completing tasks on time. It pointed out issues with both the funding of transportation in the school system and with overconfidence in the new bus contractor they hired. And for issues that still need to be addressed, I'm pressing school officials asking how they plan to do it. After a first day of school fiasco in Howard County Schools back in 2023. Just totally a mess. With bus routes that were botched. So it's very frustrating. Daily delays. And the first day was a disaster and now we're in the fourth week of school and we're still having a lot of problems. And Zoom, the bus contractor dealing with major transportation troubles, despite being awarded an $81 million contract from the school system. Now this new audit is showing what went wrong. The failures in transportation last fall resulted from missteps and actions that were taken internally as well as externally. An independent review of the Howard County Schools transportation system by Prismatic Services says the school bus situation was caused by unfilled staff positions, a lack of deadlines and an overconfidence in Zoom. School board member Dr. Chen says it's a difficult to face in the mistakes, but I think it's really good to honestly look at that. The report also found the school system had been underspending on transportation, spending only about 3.9 to 4.3 percent of the budget. The report says best practices suggest a school system should spend around 4 to 6 percent of the overall budget instead. They're also the only school system in the state outsourcing 100 percent of its bus operations. We are improving and we're learning from our mistakes. Leading up to the first day of school in August, Dr. Tatia Prieto with Prismatic says there were problems. She says documents showed the bus contractor Zoom overstated their abilities, had holes in their technology, didn't have enough drivers and didn't practice the routes before the first day. Many of the routes they ran weren't the routes that were intended. Finding out that the bus drivers did not practice the route, that is not a good um, representation of what we're dealing with. But in a statement from Zoom, they say they quote, strongly disagree with the statements in the audit, saying last year's challenges were analyzed and factored into the preparation for this year, leading to their routes being covered and on time. And while school board members say transportation is already improving. With a primarily contractor uh, operated fleet, um, the importance of expectations that are, are clear and consistently enforced um, can't be overstated. Prieto says there still aren't clear performance expectations from the school system being communicated to contractors. The second part of that is holding the contractors accountable. So I asked both the Howard County School System and school board leadership if they plan to create performance expectations for contractors and what their expectations are. I also asked how they'll hold contractors accountable moving forward and if they will increase funding for transportation. And the school system will continue to work with our partners to, to uh, address those recommendations. And I did also ask for an interview with school officials, but so far I have yet to get responses to my questions. And in a statement the school superintendent released, he says Zoom has trained over 150 new school bus drivers to help overcome shortages. In the studio, Jessica Babb, Fox 45 News. I'm Mary Bubala. Thank you for watching. Here's another video for you to watch. Also take some time to subscribe to our YouTube channel.